There has been growing attention on career and technical education because of the recognition of the skills gap that exists. There's a huge disparity between the skills that employers are looking for and the skills that job seekers actually have. Recognizing the need for post-secondary education is important, but there are two other pieces that are missing, employability skills and technical skills, and career and technical education provides both of that to learners. Having been a student and a teacher in career and technical education and an administrator at the state level and at the local level, career and technical education is a topic that's very personal to me. Here at AIR, I'm working on a variety of topics related to college and career readiness with an emphasis on career and technical education. To best prepare students for successful college and career experiences, career and technical education needs to do three things. First, be widely accessible to all students. Second, be aligned with the needs of the workforce. And third, be linked to real life learning and career experiences. Career and technical education is really advantageous to those students who need it most, boys and youth from low-income families. Recent studies show that youth from low-income families are 25% more likely to graduate high school if they concentrate in career and technical education. But for those students who go on to college, career and technical education is equally as valuable. More than 40% of college students change their major at least once. If students can explore career opportunities while in high school, then they are better prepared to make decisions once they enter college. And it's important that we continue to focus on career and technical education in this way so that we are preparing students to meet the workforce demands of the future.